I accept that I came with really good reason into this physical body and I accept that I am much more than I know than I can ever really know because there's a part of me that is non physically focused that I just don't have any way of describing in physical terms I want to sense and feel and know that part of me most of all I want to know my own personal power I want to feel the friendship and the harmony and the attention of the non-physical part of me but the only way that I can really feel it is in the way that things manifest so I want to be a fully present person here in my physical now and I want to use the power of my mind the word focus is the most essential part of this conversation I want to use the power of my mind to focus myself into alignment with all that I have become and to focus myself into alignment with all that I become means to focus myself energetically it means to focus myself mentally but what it really means is to focus myself emotionally so I'm not reaching for thoughts I don't want to project future experiences I'm not making lists of things that I want to have or be or do one day I'm making lists of things that I want to feel right here and now and often things that I want to feel often in my experience things like fun and things like clarity and things like joy things like friendship things like flexibility things like just knowing that all is well a feeling of well-being is something that I really like to experience I want to feel full and fun I want to feel fast I like to feel the feeling of momentum and speed I want to feel exhilaration I want to feel passion I enjoy feeling all of these things now, as we're saying these words nothing's really moving not just with you but with anyone because the words are just words they're words that are meaningful words in other words the word fun means something to you but just saying the word fun has not really produced any emotion of fun so let's pick another word that may be easier to produce some emotion I like to be interested in things does that ring your bells in any way not so much fun <laughs> I like to have fun give oh. us some word that feels meaningful to you I love yeah. to feel the magic of the just experience the subtleties and the the power that I can manifest. All right, magic is a good word. I like to feel the magic. What's another word that describes that? I like to feel the magic. I like to feel the power. Yes, I, would I like to feel the power of the magic. I'd like to I like to feel <laughs> I like to feel the universe yielding to me. I like to find that sweet spot. I like to find that place where I can just feel things queued up for me. I like to feel that clicking into place place. I like to, to know that I'm right there. I like to feel the power of my focus. I like to know that I have the ability to project my mind. I like being on a ship. I like to feel the rhythm of the ship. I like feeling that the ship knows what it's doing I like to feel the well-being of the ship I like knowing that this captain cares about his passengers and is looking at his experience in a very precise way that he's taking care of those of us who are on board that we matter to him and that in the same way that we are moving with the rhythm of this ship that there is a rhythm in the universe that I'm moving with too and that there are those that are looking after me that are looking on for me that are aware of me that have my best interest in mind that I have uh, uh, hooked up with that I'm co-creating with and that well-being is the order of the life for me I like knowing that whatever I am willing to allow that the universe will yield to me and that it's just up to me to goose up my ability to allow it I'm really feeling good about myself these days I'm proud of what I figured out I'm proud that I managed to get on board this ship and have this experience with all of these people and I'm looking forward to the further clarity that comes from it but most of all I just want to sort of sit and revel or resonate in the energy of well-being and feel good about what I've accomplished and where I am sitting in a room with hundreds of people and managed to raise my hand the poor girl got thrown off the stage to make room for me just now I must be I'm I'm doing wow. I'm doing all right here the clarity of my wanting is strong my allowing is a little bit weak because I'm not really trusting myself as much as I can but I'm coming to trust myself more and more all the time I'm beginning to accept that things are working out for me that that's the way that it is supposed to be and I'm not in a big hurry to goose the evidence of that up. I'm just ready to rest in that knowing that things are working out for me 
and I like paying attention I'm gonna watch for the subtleties I like the word subtle the word subtle that I use often and the word magic that I use often don't go together very well because magic feels bigger but I'm gonna start looking for the subtle magic I'm gonna watch for the subtle evidence of things working out for me and I'm going to notice it take note of it stop and at least comment on it when I see things that are coming to me in an obvious way I have a sense that the more I notice the more I'll resonate with it the more I resonate with it the more will come the more that comes the more I'll notice the more I notice the more I'll resonate the more that resonates the more will come the more that comes the more I'll notice the more I'll resonate so I can feel that I'm off on a really good track here all is really well with me and this is enough of an exercise for me in any moment in time I really don't have to make a big deal about this this is much easier than I've ever thought it was tending to my point of attraction is really just about talking myself soothing myself into a place of positive expectation of things coming to me and then watching for the evidence that comes thereafter now this has been a good conversation we've enjoyed it a lot as we visited with you we felt where our words were in the beginning and what you were receiving we were projecting energy to you in a stronger way than we were projecting words but every word we offered was in concert with the energy that we were projecting and we sensed you as we were offering it and we felt an opening a sort of softening of resistance within you we can see it in your eyes we can feel it in every part of your being so you've accomplished through this conversation sort of like hypnosis a lot of others are falling out of their seats out there at the same time so what's happening here is now you're in a place a softer place of allowing you're in that place of allowing the universe to demonstrate for you in more rendezvous in more obvious ways and that's what you're reaching for and really we don't want to burst any bubbles but that's all there is to this that's all there is to preparing your grid it's just about being willing to take the time to talk yourself into that softer place of just feeling general and gentle and loving so now we're going to ask for you just some words of what you're feeling emotional words tell us what is the strongest word that you're feeling what is the strongest emotion put it in try to use one word if you can well I, I just feel try to use one word love. If you can. love yeah, yeah. gratitude well, Sorry, that's too well that's all right one at a time is what we meant that gratitude is your response to the love but just go back to the feeling of love and just accept the feeling of love because you don't have to be grateful for the feeling of love is the most natural thing in the world and attention to it noticing it is all of the appreciation that ever needs to be offered you don't have to use a word like grateful you just have to notice the feeling of the word love what else what other emotion do you feel right now don't reach too hard for just allowing and peaceful satisfied peaceful yeah. love knowing yeah. well-being there's another feel for it <laughs> there's another one feel for it I'm just envisioning my children don't envision don't okay. envision anything envisioning is the future acceptance yeah. <laughs> so now go back to the word love go back to the word love so self love because that takes care of everything in other words that word love you cannot possibly be missing the love that we are projecting to you you can't be missing it so just accept it and enjoy it and acknowledge it and understand that it's always there but we're not often in proximity where we can talk you into it we just held your undivided attention long enough that we got your attention you see and that was the sort of rampage that you were looking for but you have to talk yourself into this on a regular basis we would encourage you that you do it every morning at the beginning of the day but stop take the time to talk yourself into the vibration of this your inner being and those like us adore you we are there and projecting to you all the time it is ridiculous that you don't feel it more of the time it is really something that is being offered to you all of the time but it's something that you have to tune into we can't offer it enough in other words what happened here it wasn't our brilliance we weren't even that brilliant we were just saying love 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 it was your attention to it and your willingness in other words we just stayed in a general setting long enough we didn't get off on any tangents we just stayed there long enough projecting what we know to be and how we feel about you until you caught a little whiff of it you see but this self-love is what you're reaching for and if, if you don't take the time to find it if you don't take the time to find self-love then you can't possibly find the state of allowing because your point of attraction that's the basis of your point of attraction so
So if you're self-critical or if you're looking into the future for something that hasn't manifest, which means you're feeling the absence of it right now, it doesn't matter how many goal sheets you write out. It doesn't matter how many people you talk to, and it doesn't matter how many people or non-physical entities that you talk into giving you rampages of appreciation. <laughs> if you don't find a way to find that feeling of love, then you don't have the starting point and nothing can flow into your grid. But now plenty can flow into your grid. So as it flows into your grid, make the association of what you not we what you accomplished here by your willingness to present yourself in this way ask the most important question of the day and then allow us to rampage vibrationally our love